Merch Chaffer here with Claudia. Claudia, I am sure you are sick of answering the question, but why did you take Ty instead of Daniel to the final two? Uh, yeah, I know I'm going to get asked this question. Everyone's wondering this, but truly I believed in the game that I played and I wasn't afraid to sit next to Ty at the end of this. I felt like I played a strong game socially competitive. I was strategic in the way that I moved in this house. So I believed in the game I played and yeah, maybe I was naive to think that maybe it was, maybe it was crazy, but yeah. <laughs> Uh, for fans of the show who questioned your decision and believe that you single-handedly evicting the player that has the most wins in Big Brother Canada history would have been a game-winning move, how do you respond? Yeah, I mean, like I said, people watching the show get a full view of what is going on. And when we're living it, you know, we only have, you know, what, what we have to go off of. And I made the decision that I felt was best in that moment. I wanted to stay loyal to that final two and, and stick to my word and taking him. And I wasn't scared to stand next to that resume. You know, I won those comps too. And I played a social game and I got myself to the end. So, you know, I made the decision that felt right in the moment and, and I don't have any regrets. And, and looking back, like, I know you said you don't have any regrets, but do you think now sort of like, you know, the day after, if you had taken Daniel, do you think you would have received more jury votes or do you think it would have been sort of like a, a similar result? You know, it's hard to know. It's hard to know what that jury is thinking. Um, I can't wait to watch that round table and see kind of what they were thinking. But I, I don't think it would have been uh, easy, like for sure, win or anything with Daniel. I think it's still, you know, he had the crown sitting in that jury there was a lot of people, you know, he's such a lovable person. He played an amazing social game. So I don't think it would have, I think it would have been tough with anyone. We At the end there, you know, we all played very strong games. You went from nominating Ty to choosing to take him to the final two. Can you explain how your dynamic changed through the game? Yeah, I mean, as everyone saw, we had a pretty chaotic relationship in here and it was a lot of ups and downs and I did put him on the block. Uh, but I think it goes back to being able to adapt in this game. And as you know, things are changing every single week and every time somebody leaves the house, you kind of have to look at the remaining house guests and where you're positioned and how you're going to get to the end. Um, so, you know, at the time that I put him on the block, I felt good in, in the six that I was talking about, which was Shania, Renee, Kuzi, Anika, and Daniel, like that was where I felt safe and good. And then, you know, fast forward a couple, a couple weeks into that double. It also at that time, I, I saw relationships changing and I saw Shanae getting closer to Daniel C and Anika. And I felt like not as safe in that. And at that time, I felt like Ty and I teaming up was going to be a powerhouse duo to get us to that end. So I think it just comes back to adapting your game. Did Renee voting for Ty to win surprise you? Yes and no. I think Johnny's vote surprised me more because I mean, I, I, thought I would have Johnny's vote. I think Renee, I could, I, it wasn't something I didn't think about. I thought she could vote for Ty. I think she's a big fan of this game. Uh, but I really just wanted everyone to look at it objectively and, you know, hear us out and, and do what they felt was best. There's no hard feelings there. What's more important to you, love or money? Uh, money? <laughs> I don't know. That's a tough question. I don't know. Um, yeah, I think at the end of the day, like I just want to be proud of the game that I played and the mark that I made on this game. Um, so yeah, I it's tough. <laughs> the money is important. I wanted to win this game, but like I said, I believed in what I did here. And finally, we know the East Coast always supports their players. You lasted longer than Jonathan in the house. Were you surprised that he was voted Canada's favorite? Absolutely not. Johnny is an amazing person. He's the sweetest guy. I'm so happy that I, you know, met him in here. I was so happy to see him get Canada's favorite. Amazing. Claudia, thank you so much. Thank you.